Once again, the reins of power change hands in Russia. At a joint session in the Kremlin of both houses of the Supreme Soviet, it was announced that Mr. Malenkov had resigned, and later, that Marshal Bulganin was the new Prime Minister. Both of these two men were little in the limelight when Joseph Stalin was alive. There could be only one dictator in Russia. Then Stalin died early in 1953, and the world wondered who he had chosen to succeed him. We quickly learned that one of his right-hand men, Malenkov, was now the boss. A few days ago, the Supreme Soviet met, and the chairman read a letter from Malenkov. It stated, after vague references to his inefficient managing of agriculture, that he had resigned. This move follows lengthy behind-the-scenes struggles for power, though many thought Khrushchev might seize control. Bulganin, on the left, may be only a figurehead premier with Khrushchev the real power. Meanwhile, the political bombshell dropped in the Kremlin sends its tremors around the world.